La vuelta. Let's go. Let's go. Hi, I'm. Hi, I'm nervous. Okay. Hi, I'm Sean Dixon Sullivan, coordinator at Camp Contour Lines and founder of the nonprofit Contour Lines Corps, which helps rural communities transition their lands away from slash and burn into agroforestry, which both restores ecological health and generates economic wealth. Slash and burn corn, it means devegetation of entire hillsides, which in this high rainfall, steep terrain tropics, it means severe soil erosion. Also the use of chemical herbicides and the corn monocultures, it further degrades soil fertility and biodiversity. So on the bright side, the communities, they understand this. They understand that corn monocultures are bad for their wallets and for their lands. These projects are 100% owned by local communities planted on their lands. The produce is sold or consumed by their families. That's why we've seen such high successes with high survival rates on our trees and high participation among the communities. So they have the land, they have the manpower, and they have the willpower to make this transition. The only thing lacking is the funds to start to buy the fruit trees and to break free from that, that cycle of slash and burn corn. We're raising this money to plant 36 sites across three villages, El Cedro, La Pintada, and La Guaira Cocoli, totaling 2,700 fruit trees, 11,000 legume trees, and 14,000 annuals, mainly pineapple, cassava, and plantain, while training 82 local men and women and transitioning 25 acres out of slash and burn and into agroforestry, which will touch the lives of 2,500 locals. In the last 18 months, we've planted 21 project sites. The owners of those have selected and trained who will become the owners of these project sites, funded by this campaign, thanks to good people like you. Sounds good. That sounded good. All right.